Hello and welcome to the channel Automation Step by Step. Today is Friday, so let us begin our Q&A Friday episode. And today we are going to take up a question asked by Jogi Reddy. And he says, I have two years of experience in manual testing and now I am looking for a job change to Selenium. I have Go Java knowledge and implemented some basic scripts in Selenium using WebDriver. I have learned only test ng framework. Now my question is, do we have to learn frameworks like data-driven POM, hybrid frameworks, keyword-driven etc. to crack the interview and which are all the skills still I need to improve? Can you please share the interview questions also? I have seen your videos. It is good. I am expecting some good suggestions from you so that I can move forward. Please can you give me the reply? Jogi Reddy, thank you for asking this question and in your case, because you already have knowledge of Java and Selenium, it is the best and very appropriate time for you to move into automation testing. And my suggestion to you will be, uh, you can keep on increasing your skill set, but do not wait for adding all your skills and then going for a job change or then going for the interview. You can start applying, you can start appearing in interviews and meanwhile, you can keep on learning keyword driven data driven and pom concepts as you mentioned in your query so uh, you can keep on adding skills with selenium like the uh, different kinds of frameworks different kind of concepts with selenium and also you can uh, learn some other skills like a ci tool like jenkins or jmeter for performance testing that will add to your skills also uh, one other thing that i will suggest you is in case you have an opportunity to move into automation testing in your own organization, you can do that because that will give you some real world and enterprise level project experience in automation testing before you finally go for a new job. So in case that is possible, you can do that and you can still uh, search for new jobs and keep on searching and adding to your skill set. And the next part for Selenium interview questions that you asked. I will very soon have a sessions for Selenium interview questions. So keep watching and stay tuned for that. So that was all in today's session of Q&A Friday. In case you have any query that you want to be featured in the next episode of Q&A Friday, you can send me your questions at ask.qnafriday at gmail.com. Also send your name and location. I will meet you in the next episode. Thank you for watching.